Hey everyone, this is Lauren, aka the Watermelon Woman, and I am coming with you at my newest video and my first one, testing a product for fruit. This case will be watermelon. So right here we have a watermelon knife. This is the exterior like shield of it. As you can see, there's like little cutouts, shape of seeds. So I'm going to take this out. And there you can see all the little black seeds on the design of the knife. Um, serrated edge. So, in theory, it should really be able to cut through very well. And right here, I have a nice, fairly big, but not huge, seeded watermelon. Because I've been wanting to try seeded, because I know they're supposed to taste better than seedless. So, I'm gonna ready to crack into this and have some this morning. Um, there's... Do you know, different ways of cutting. Uh, you can cut lengthwise here. You can cut, you know, in half, scoop things out, stuff like that. I'm gonna try it lengthwise because I know the seeds come in like strips. So if you find a layer of seeds, you can just like cut that small little layer out, and you'll won't have to worry about too many seeds. Um, although I don't mind spinning them out, but, um, so I'm going to try this out and see how the knife cuts. This is kind of one of those, as seen on TV, sort of products, gadgets. So, kind of hard to do this one-handed, but. I'll put you down a second. Okay, so it went through pretty easily. Um, it's kind of stuck in there right now, but went in there pretty well. Try to finish the cut here. Okay, I'm just, ah, I'm just up. Okay, so first impressions, color-wise, it's coming off darker on the camera than it is in person. It's a little bit paler in person than we we'll expect, but it's very nice and crispy looking. Very nice. So you can see there, that's where the seed pockets were. A couple seeds there. But on this side, there's the seed pockets. So, pretty easy to just kind of slice in here. You should be able to pop out that like seed pocket there. Yep. 
There is some more down there though. But that's kind of nice and easy. And as you can see, it's got more of the white um, kind of fibrous parts that kind of holding the seeds in there. So that isn't always the tastiest part to eat. So, you know, it's there, it's holding the seeds in. But anyway, none of this is gonna go away, so I'll probably eat that and spit the seeds out. And I'll probably just go at this with a spoon, <laughs> be honest. But um, if you're cutting it up, you know, if you wanna serve it and you just wanna easily get some of the seeds out, yeah, this is totally easy to do. So, the watermelon knife. Would I advise you to buy it? I think that if you want a pretty looking uh, watermelon knife, then yeah, it works. It's cute. Um, but, there's a butt. If you have a bread knife like this, both serrated, I think it works just as well as this. So, really, if you have something like this, just go ahead and use it. You know, um, I don't think you have to buy this. But, I got it at, I can't remember if it was a yard sale or a thrift store. Um, somebody else picked it up, really, but, uh, so we didn't pay that much for it, but it is cute. It is kind of a, more of a novelty gadget, um, rather than like, oh, this is going to revolutionize your... Watermelon cutting. Yeah. I don't know about that, but it's cute and it works. So if you see it for cheap, go ahead and pick it up. Anyway, I'm going to dig in with this watermelon. Yeah. All right. I'll see you for the next video. Bye.